Satyendranath Bose was an eminent physicist after whom bosons one of the two classes of particles in quantum mechanics was named he was a self-taught scholar who rose to prominence during the 1920s for his work on quantum mechanics and went on to work with the renowned german physicist albert einstein he became a research scholar at a time when new discoveries were being made in the field of physics quantum theory and related concepts were creating a stir in the scientific community and Bose did some important work in this field particularly on the Planck's black body radiation law he sent his work to Albert Einstein who recognized the significance of Indian scientists finding and soon collaborated with him to work on certain important ideas that formed the basis of Bose Einstein statistics Bose was a polygot and also had varied interests in diversified fields such as philosophy, arts and music. Physicist Satyendranath Bose was born in Kolkata, West Bengal, India on 1st January 1984. The eldest and only male of the seven children, Bose was a brainiac early on he passed the entrance exam to the Hindu College, one of the India's oldest school with flying colors and stood fifth in order of merit. From there, Bose attended Presidency College where he took an intermediate science course and studied with renowned scientist Jagadish Chandra Bose and Prafulla Chandra Rai. Bose received a Bachelor's of Science in Mixed Mathematics in 1913 from Presidency College and a Master of Science in the same subject in 1915 from Calcutta University. He received such high scores on the exams for each degree that not only he was the first standing but for the latter he even created a new record in Annals of University of Calcutta which has been yet to be surpassed. Fellow student Meghnath Saha who would later work with Bose came in second standing. Between his two degrees, Bose married Usha Devi at age 20. After completing his master's degree, Bose became a research scholar at the University of Calcutta in 1916 and began his studies on the theory of relativity. He also set up new departments and laboratories there to teach undergraduate and graduate courses. While studying at the University of Calcutta, Bose also served as a lecturer in the physics department. In 1919, he and Saha prepared the first English language book based on German and French translations of Albert Einstein's original spatial and general relativity papers. The pair continued to present papers on theoretical physics and pure mathematics for several years following. In 1921, Bose joined the physics department at the University of Dhaka, which had then been recently formed and went on to establish new departments, laboratories and libraries in which he could teach advanced courses. He wrote a paper in 1924 in which he derived Planck quantum radiation law without referencing classical physics which he was able to do by counting states with identical properties the paper would later prove seminal in creating the field of quantum statistics Bose sent the paper to Albert Einstein in Germany and the scientist reorganized its importance translated it into German and submitted it on Bohr's behalf to the prestigious scientific journal the publication led to recognition and Bose was granted a leave of absence to work in Europe for two years where he worked alongside Einstein and Marie Curie among others. Einstein had adopted Bose's idea and extended it to atoms which led to prediction of existence of phenomena that became known as the Bose-Einstein condensate. After his stay in Europe Bose returned to the University of Dhaka in 1926. 
although he did not have a doctorate. Einstein had recommended that he be made a professor and Bose was made head of physics department. But upon his return, Bose did not publish for a significant period of time. According to July 2012 New York Times article in which Bose is described as the father of the God particle. He published another physics paper in 1937 and in the early 1950s worked on unified field theories. After 25 years in Dhaka, Bose moved back to Kolkata in 1945 and continued to research and teach there until his death in 1974. Several Nobel Prizes were awarded for research related to the concepts of the Boson and the Bose-Einstein condensate. Bose was never awarded a Nobel Prize despite his work on particle statistics which clarified the behavior of photons and opened the door of the new ideas on statistics of microsystems that obey the rules of quantum theory. According to physicist Jayant Nerlikar, who said Bose's finding was one of the top 10 achievements of 28th century of Indian science. But Bose himself responded simply when asked how he felt about the Nobel Prize snub. He said, I got all the recognition I deserve. The Indian government honored Bose in 1954 with Padma Vibhushan, the second highest civilian award in India. Five years later, he was appointed as the national professor, the highest honor in the country for a scholar. Bose remained in the position for 15 years. Bose also became an advisor to the Council of Scientific and Industrial Research as well as president of the Indian Physical Society and the National Institute of Science. He was elected general president of the Indian Science Congress and president of the Indian Statistical Institute. In 1958, he became a fellow of the Royal Society. About 12 years after Bose's death on February 4, 1974, the Indian Parliament established the S.N. Bose National Centre for Basic Sciences in Salt Lake, Kolkata. Thank you for watching Edupedia World. Please subscribe to watch more videos.